Hey folks, just wanted to do this video on some Microsoft Word uh, little tricks. And so this one is going to be on how to create an invisible table so that you can have two people's signatures or multiple uh, columns um, without the boxes being around them. And I know this has come in handy for me many times and hopefully you will see why. So where you go is you go to insert table and say you want to insert uh, to you know have this divider down the down the page and you're going to have like a signature line going on here you know and uh, something like this you know like first witness uh, you know, name, right? So John Smith or whatever the whatever the name is, right? And maybe the date, maybe their address, what whatever it is that you're putting there. You might have first witness name and their address. Okay. And then in the second column, you want to put your second witness. I know that you know this will be done a lot of times if in, pl in place of a notary um, or on a two witnesses signing on the declaration of a trust, different things like that. So you've got your you got your stuff above here, you know your document, and at the bottom you got your two witnesses. But you know you don't want these boxes around around this you've separated the page in half so how do you get rid of the box around it well I'll show you how you highlight the box where do we go home and you hover over this little thing under here and you hit no border and that's it man that's basically how you do it uh, another thing that might come in handy is you're, you're doing something like um, you know more complex like this and you're putting you're putting stuff in here in three columns right and again you go back to home you highlight this little thing that pops up here when you hover over the, there in the top left and you hit this and you hit no border now they, they you can keep some of the borders you could you know there's lots of options here but usually I just hit no border and now you separated your your stuff there okay so I hope that that's helpful for some of you a little Microsoft Word trick that comes in handy when you're creating um, your own you know legal documents and things like that